I wanted to say hello, hop on and do a quick live because I'm getting ready to put together my latest estate sale, which includes some absolutely yummy, yummy, yummy treasures um, from a collector in uh she's in the in the on the west coast and she's looking to downsize and it's quite an eclectic little mix of miniatures but it just all comes together so beautifully and warmly and whimsically and that's not a word but i just made it up and i wanted to share because i'm getting ready i'm sh i'm getting ready to shoot the collection for um Hi guys, say hello if you're just joining. I wanted to shoot the collection. I have to shoot the collection to promote it. Um, so I'm going to share share some of these pieces. Um, a lot of them are unsigned. So like these flowers are unsigned, but aren't they just lovely? The same is with um, some of the uh, furniture pieces. But anyway, in this in this estate sale there are a number of beautiful art dolls including this one and this one um there's actually well uh, there's like four of them anyway um so this is another piece which i am just so thrilled with it's a mermaid chair it looks like they're hand painted it's hand painted upholstery but obviously the the shape of the backing uh, is very seashell-like. It's unsigned. It's kind of crazy that somebody made that and decided not to sort of show off there um, that they, you know, made it. Another two, there's this, The this is another pair uh, of pieces that are unsigned. Um, they're absolutely gorgeous. These are sterling silver candelabras. And they're gorgeous, and they're unsigned, and I just don't know who made them. Um, so these two pieces are part of the estate sale. Pa Some of the more whimsical things, like are over the top, is this pair of Siamese cats. Um, again, not signed. They appear to be commercially manufactured pieces, but look to be hand-painted and certainly hand-embellished. I just think they're the best. Um non-traditional very whimsical what is very traditional in this sale includes these cats um i can't think of the maker offhand i believe her name is inez and she's out of italy and just look how beautiful they are apparently these are polymer clay made of polymer um without molds and she made a, a very uh, concerted effort to make sure that because they're certificates of art authenticity authenticity they're included look how beautiful look at even the paws the detail are on the paws and the whiskers look at the whiskers i'm gonna uh, crazy crazy um so these are polymer clay handcrafted through the out molds made by Anna inez out of italy this will all be included in each of the lot listings these this sale will go live this sunday um it's about 45 lots so it's a relatively small sale for me um but it is a tight assortment of really really special pieces um you can see me in the mirror there um <laughs> gonna hide so let me take you through some of the some of the other pieces um so i mentioned the art dolls these guys but there are also these um beautiful like miniature dolls is what they are like think antique replica like antique dolls like real traditional dolls not dollhouse dolls these are mini versions of those it's kind of crazy and they're gorgeous i i'm gonna i don't know the name terrible but again the the names will be in the listings um god they're just really pat bolt that's the name. Her name is Pat Bolt. Thank you. It came to me. Um, sh there's actually three of Pat Bolt pieces in in this sale. She's actually very popular. Um, I don't know if she's still around. I don't know if she's still making dolls. But look at the level of detail. I'm sure these are porcelain. 
um, faces, hand painted. I mean, the dressings are beautiful. Um, there's a bunch of silver pieces in this sale. Some of them are oversized, um, but like this is a little overscaled, but in the right setting, it could work. All sterling silver. I don't know who made it. I don't know if it's signed. Um, this is actually 10 karat gold. Isn't that, this is actually made by Don Henry. He's a very popular maker of silver. So this is 10 plated, 10 karat plated gold. There are none, like I said, there's a number of, of other silver pieces. This is gorgeous. Oh my God. There's a communion chalice, but back there, there is, I'm not going to get it out. It's a 10 karat gold swan in miniature. I believe that's Don Henry. But I think this, uh, well, there's a couple of things before I get to the signature piece from the collection. It's not this. This is another one of the oversized pieces. It's, it's a, it's a crystal studded egg. I don't know what else to say. Um, you know, I don't know what it would be used for, but it is lined on the inside and it's gorgeous. Um, maybe a child's room filled with toys. I don't know. What would you say? Guys, what would you do with this? It is, it's so really stunning. It's just stunning. Stunning. Um, there's another one of the flower baskets or the flower boxes, the window boxes. It's just lovely. Again, not signed. Don't know who did it. Um, this is a very eclectic mix, I would call it. Whimsical for sure. But I think, well, there's two pieces. The the, the mermaid chair is fabulous. And then the, the companion piece to it. These are commercially manufactured pieces that are hand embellished by the artist. And you could see the work in the painting. It's, um, it's a Cupid design. It's lovely. It's just lovely. So, but I think the, the real, the signature piece pieces for this lineup is going to be is going to be this assortment of three pieces. One, two, three. Hand painted, again, on commercial, on commercially manufactured furniture. But look at all the work. Look at all the beautiful paint, hand painted uh, scenes that are on here. Obviously, swans, floral decorations. It's painted on the sign, I guess, the sides. That's, I guess, is wisteria. Um, and then you have this beautiful bench embellished with crystals. Or I don't know if that's crystals. And then you have this other bench, which is upholstered and sort of matching and decorated. And it's just such a lovely, lovely, lovely um, uh, lineup. So I hope you enjoyed this little look. This this assortment goes up on sale this Sunday at 7 p.m. Um, there's a sale happening right now. If you're looking for Christmas stuff, go check it out. There's a link in my bio and you can check out my sales and you can also follow me and sign up on my website for my letter updates, my email updates. So you know what's going on and you want to shop my sales. So have a great day, guys. Thank you so much for watching.